Aunt Jemima some cream, darling. Then I'll mix myself a cocktail and I'll see you on the patio. I'm just going to make some cocoa and bathe the cat's yeah. boil, then I'm off to bed. <laughs> Any danger with another beer, Bert? Yeah, help us over in the fridge, Deb. <laughs> Margaret, my darling. Edward, darling. <laughs> oh, no, Edward, we can't. Not with my husband in the next room. <laughs> right, damn it. <laughs> I shall be back. I shall return, darling. Every second out of your arms is... Like an eternity. <laughs> ah, that's better. She's on the boil now. <laughs> Who's on the boil? Your wife doing the cat's boil. Got the poor little thing on the table now. Uh, it? Oh, look at that. Look. Come right off me hand. Do you mind having another? No, help yourself. Made you like that. <laughs> darling, darling. <laughs> darling, I feel like a volcano waiting to erupt. I want to make mad, torrid love you with every fiber of my being. Later, darling, come to my room. Very well, but remember, I'm a wild, untamed beast. <laughs> wild animal passion. <laughs> uh, there we are. <laughs> Your wife's got to put her back out tonight again, I think. <laughs> put her back out? Doing what? The cat. Going to put the cat out tonight again, you know, now she's finished bathing the boil, all right? I'm off up now, then. All right, love. Oh, by the way, Ted, I've taken them off so you won't have to fumble about. <laughs> <laughs> Off what? What? Take off what? So you won't have to fumble about what? The rings off the other cans of beer in the kitchen. <laughs> I want to speak to my husband. It's your Doreen. Oh. oh. <coughs> Took her mother's prescription round this afternoon. She wanted to know how she's getting on a spit. Oh, yeah. Hello, dear. Don't you hello, dear me. I know what's going on round there. You're having an affair with Jeremy's wife, aren't you? Yeah, that's right. I've given her the full treatment. <laughs> you disgusting little reprobate. How many wives do you need, for heaven's sake? Two, three times a day. <laughs> you know, to ease the pain a bit. <laughs> what sort of woman is she? Sort of grabs you out the back of your legs, you know. <laughs> Pulled out the back. She's got a flaming nerve. Yes, it's sciatica. <laughs> you cheap little philanderer. I'm leaving you. All right, bye-bye, dear. Oh, just remembered. Where are you going now? Well, I've left my sweets in the car. Shan't be a second. Well, see you or not, that's all. Just see you or not. So-and-so. You are wonderful, darling. Darling, you were sensational. Oh, spiff for Before a game. You... <laughs> I haven't forgotten our love, too. Oh, darling, you're so kind and gentle and sweet. <laughs> Sweets from the sweet. Sweets from the sweet. Oh, murder a little devil. Oh, kill him. Oh, kill him. Hey, I'll pair dropper. You'll have a pair drop. You'll not care. What you think? 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 Well, come over me. Oh. You got it all mixed up, but you see, it's a program on the telly. Yeah. It's a play, you see. Off, on, you see yeah, what I mean? I know. I know, yeah. I'm watching the telly and think it's happening in real life, like, you know. Oh, dear, I think I've got a bit of a terrible headache. I don't know why. Yeah, you do that, love. Yeah. 
No, it did. <gasps> Alone at last, Sharon. <laughs> Oh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> I knew you and her were having a ding dong. You rotten little swine. <laughs> Let me out of here. Let me out. Let me out of here. <laughs> <laughs>